Now, your WLKY weather with Chief Meteorologist Jay Cardosi. All right, beautiful weather out there on this Monday late afternoon, largely in part because of all that comfortable humidity. And this time of year especially, we like to take a look at the dew point temperatures because as they rise, it feels more muggy. It's harder for you to cool off when you're outside. When we have dew points in the 40s and 50s, it is absolutely delightful. That's what we have right now. Very, very comfortable air. When we get into the mid and upper 60s, it feels sticky. And this past weekend, as early as yesterday morning, we were in the oppressive range, the 70 degree mark or higher. Well, guess what's on the way? Some of that thick humidity is going to be making a return to our region. Not until, though, tomorrow afternoon. Future dew points, those dew points will be climbing again into the mid and upper 60s by this time tomorrow. So enjoy what we have right now, right? It's going to be wonderful tonight through tomorrow morning. Outside right now, live look, the TriMark camera network. That's 71 northbound. That's the Gene Snyder there. Uh, just underneath the banner and we got uh, some slow goings on as it typically is moving towards Oldham County right there. At least it's a beautiful day. Just keep the windows down and enjoy that fresh air and even 80 right now that humidity 35% and northeasterly breeze around 10 miles an hour. Here's the big picture. Started this day with tons of sunshine. Now just a few high clouds are rolling into the region. It's going to stay very comfortable, no question about it, as we go from near 80 at 7 down into the low 70s. This is the city, mind you, by 11 o'clock tonight. Outline regions will be even cooler. Matter of fact, when you wake up in the morning, we'll see another morning that's going to feature temperatures upper 50s and low 60s. That's free air conditioning this time of year, expecting 62 in the city. Here's a look at the future cast. Now we'll start out bright and sunny with that low humidity. And then that humidity will start to ramp up in the afternoon with it. A few of those cumulus clouds and high temperatures. We're gonna heat it up by late day. We're back in the upper 80s and low 90s tomorrow, looking at 93. And as the humidity continues to go up midweek on Wednesday and a weak front approaches, there will be chances for a few scattered showers and storms. Best chances will come later in the day on into Wednesday evening. So here's our forecast now for the evening. Few clouds and just simply beautiful 70s back into the 60s. Your detailed 12 hour forecast for tomorrow, we start out at 62, that's the city, 50s in the outline regions. And then we're gonna start heating it up as humidity also makes a return. We'll be in the low 90s by late afternoon. And with that higher humidity, Rick Jennifer, a chance for some scattered storms Wednesday, the 4th of July and Friday. I think the second half of the long holiday weekend will be a little less humid as a result. It'll be dry Saturday and Sunday, mm -hmm. but still on the warm side. So plenty of dry time for outdoor activities, yeah. even on the 4th and Friday. But just know we're going to be dodging some storms. There All you right. go. All right. Nature's